Hey, and welcome to another episode of Playful Strategy Weekly. I'm Willem Vanderhorst, a Playful Strategist, and in these short videos, we go over the different themes, topics, uh, contents of the book about play that I'm reading, and we are at the moment covering the definition of play from the beginning of Man, Play, and Games by French sociologist Roger Caillois. In the first three episodes, we went through the definition points of play is free, it's separate, it's uncertain, and now number four, point number four in this episode, play is an activity that is unproductive. So as the definition goes straight from the book, uh, unproductive is creating neither goods nor wealth nor new elements of any kind. And except for the exchange of property among the players, ending in a situation identical to that prevailing at the beginning of the game. So what does that mean? It means a lot, but that's not what we're going to in these short uh, series of episodes. I am really just going over the definition and giving two different illustration points, mostly from advertising, marketing, business, knowledge, but like two different things that I can point out to different videos on YouTube. So there's going to be the links every time. And uh, those two examples are meant to be contrasting illustrations of the point, which is an interesting one because, of course, we want work, I mean, work to be productive. And I'm talking about play in the context of work, in the context of marketing, in the context of business that might be quite significant and heavy and uh, un unproductive is a tough one. But uh, there are a lot of examples of brands using something that is unproductive within this definition, I think. And the two that I chose, one is from this year's Super Bowl, uh, Porsche, the Porsche ad that was quite liked. I thought it was a fantastic ad and it is clearly a game and a lot of fun. It was called The Heist. Uh, and in it, I mean, I don't want to reveal anything. You should go watch it. But it matches a lot of definition of play for sure. I mean, very obviously. But there's something unproductive in this idea of the exchange of property among the player and ending in a situation identical to that prevailing at the beginning of the game. So something that it's like, it's, it's la voisier, the same, like another voice. Like nothing's created, nothing's lost, everything transforms. Uh, so they come back full circle at the beginning of the ad as they were at the end of the ad as they were at the beginning. So quite interesting, a lot of fun. You should check it out. Um, and that's for the first illustration example. And the second one was taking something and turning it on its head. So taking uh, this has been used by it's kind of a trope. It's become almost a trope of doing things that are quite long or boring, so seemingly unproductive. And that's the, what, the way I've used this particular example. And this is from private jet, jet company, um, private jet operator, J, JSX. And this was a ad campaign produced, an ad campaign produced in September last year, 2019, called The Longest Wait. And it's not the first of its kind. There's been a few others like it, uh, like, you know, taking the idea of doing a five second pre-roll YouTube ad as short as possible and turning it on its head and doing something that's super long. So something similar and this idea here, uh, it's not rocket science, but it's a fun one. And it's a two, so the first one minute is the ad, the actual ad, if you will. And then they do a two hour thing. Basically the idea being that if you go with them, you'll save yourself two hours of waiting at the airport. So what are you going to do with those two hours? And in this particular quirky case, we have a very long goodbye of this quirky couple that is kind of just like, well, we say goodbye, but now we have another two hours and it actually filmed on camera for two hours. So turning the idea and actually shooting two hours of quote unquote unproductive time uh, to really prove the point of what the value of this particular product is. So I thought those two ideas were quite interesting and that's about it for this fourth episode and I'll see you next week for another one. Thanks for watching and uh, don't forget to like, subscribe and all that good stuff. All right. Thanks. Bye.